Hello, this is Vince from MTL Free TV. I want to do a video on the two ways to upload IPTV sources or M3 U8 files straight into the CCloud TV database. Uh, for those of you who don't know CCloud, I've done a couple of videos on it, but it's basically a user managed database. So everybody works together to make sure that your IPTV links are up to date. And if it goes down, then you kind of scour the internet or if you found uh, places where it has a source and you just grab that source and then you add it back into the C cloud. So it's a community effort. You need to make sure that everything is up and running and working well so that everybody benefits. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you the first and the most straightforward way to go into C cloud and upload uh, your M3 U8 files is basically right here. So as soon as you come into C cloud, so C cloud, this is the website right here. So C cloud TV.org, you're going to click on upload now. Once you do that, then you're going to have this uh, Google form. You just have to fill it out. Filling out the form is very straightforward. So you have here the first part is the channel name, which in this case is TLC. The category, you have multiple categories that are here. You have the country. So based on the country code that is on the Wikipedia site, you enter the country. Uh, the language, depending on the language, of course. The stream URL is where you're going to find the, the actual link or the source. And the source needs to be an M3 U8 file or a URL or else it's not going to be valid. Right there it says. The channel logo, this one's a little bit, I guess it's a little bit trickier where you're going to need to have the logo that's associated with the channel that you'll be watching. So that when, you know, at first sight, you're going to be able to see that, oh, well, this is TLC. So what, the easiest way to do this is just go on Google. So if you go on Google and then you type in, right now, you type in TLC TV or you type in TLC logo, it's going to pull up a bunch of links. The best thing to do is to find a sturdy link. And usually the sturdy link or a stable link is for, for, the, um, for the logos is usually at the source. I picked this this link. This link is straight on the TLC website. So, you know, if there's anything that's probably more stable, there's probably not going to be anything that's much more stable than the actual TLC website. So you click on it, uh, then you actually go to the, well, I actually clicked on the link. So instead of going here, you're just going to click, you're going to click on it, and then you're going to go to view image. You click on view image, and then you're going to grab this link right here. You click on it, you grab it and then you enter it right into the list and there you have it. If you have a nickname, alias, call sign, or handle, or whatever, and you would like to receive credit for it, then you just enter that there and that's it. Once all that is done, then you're gonna click on submit and then the information is gonna be sent off. Really that simple. All right, now for the second way to upload M3 U8 files directly into the CCloud database. So from the channel listing, you'll scroll over to the status section. From the status section, you'll see three statuses. Green, which is online, that means there's three M3U8 files that have been stockpiled. Offline, which is in red, and that means there, is, there are no files that are stockpiled. And then the submit upload means that there's either one or two files that are stockpiled. Because once again, the maximum is three. Once you've located your source, you'll click on offline upload or submit upload. This will create a pop-up. The pop-up will present you with a token ID, which you'll copy. You click on OK, and then another pop-up. You enter that token that you just copied directly into the channel token ID. With the stream URL or the M3U8 file that you found, and at that point you just click update, and that's it. And so concludes the CCloud upload tutorial. So I just want to say that I'm actually really excited for CCloud. I think this is something that if everybody works together on this, we have a really reliable place to go and get all your, your live TV, uh, pretty much anything, because you can upload 24-hour channels, you can upload live TV, you can upload uh, special events, everything you can can be uploaded 
on this uh, this platform and it works with so many different devices right here on the screen are all the devices that it's compatible with which is pretty amazing so um, if you haven't seen the C cloud um, I'm actually gonna put a link right on the screen which will show you how to add it within XBMC for all the other devices just a matter of coming to the website so once again the website is cloudtv.org and uh, that's pretty much it thank you have a nice evening mm -hmm.